Hello friends, I'm going to show you how to root Carbon E21. Uh, rooting uh, is an amazing thing you can do with Android phones. Uh, it gives you developer level privileges. We can install some apps which require root. We can flash custom ROM and many things. Yeah, there are so many things you can do with rooted phones. And uh, rooting may break your phone, but there are very less chances. And there are uh, ways out there on the internet showing you how to unbreak your phone. So, so that's not a big problem. So uh, let's get started. And first, you what you need is a file called binary root for Android. Okay, uh, I've already downloaded it, and uh, it's a zip file. You have to extract it to some, to some place. I've extracted it here. This file. Root with restore by binary version 30. You will get these files. Okay. Now connect your carbon A to one with the USB cable and uh, USB debugging on, and uh, it will it will start installing drivers. Um, in case the drivers did not install successfully, you can uh, download PDNet and uh, go to the set, through the setup process, and it will give you a list of some mobile phones. Uh, Carbon is not listed there, and uh, so click the option other. There will be an option other, and uh, continue with the setup process, and your driver will be installed. Um, PDNet is actually for USB tethering, but it will uh, install drivers for your phone. Okay, so after you install the drivers and everything is okay, uh, run this file. Run me dot that. You will get this key. CMD. Okay. Now same. Device type normal, uh, special, new Xperia root, Google Glass mode, unroot. Now, carbon is listed here, so you will choose normal. For normal, type 1. Okay, now all you have to do is press enter and it will, un it will start the routing process. Please do not remove the USB cable and do not play with your phone, just leave it, leave it as it is, it will do on its own. And uh, your phone restarts several times, and that's not a problem. Okay, so after it uh, after the booting process is complete, it will give you a message showing root successful or something like that, and uh, then your phone is rooted. And so now enjoy a rooted phone, but uh, just make sure that uh, you do not remove the USB cable and uh, you do not play with your phone during the rooting process. Rest everything is simple and easy. Okay. Thank you for watching my video, uh, please subscribe, like, comment.